Hi, this is JP LaForest from Studio JPEG. In this video, we're going to be feeding these plants that have been growing for 14 days now. So this is the first repeat feeding. So we fed them on the first day that we uh, started the kit up. And now we're going to put in some more nutrients for them. So as you can see, this is the six pod version. So it says to add eight millimeters or two capfuls at startup and every two weeks. So this one is fairly easy. There's some that uh, start off lower and change as time grows. So we are at the two week mark. So we're going to be adding two capfuls in here. And I'm just going to open that and open this up. So here comes one capful. I like to make sure that I get the most liquid out of it. And here comes a second capful. And this looks like a liquid that would be prone to stain. So I do recommend that you are careful and not drop any on yourself or on your clothes specifically. And if you do drop some in a desk or something, I do recommend you wipe it off right away. So once I put the nutrients in, the other thing I like to do is to fill it up with water. And the main reason I do that is to get the right proportion of nutrients and water in the tank. So you don't want to have too many nutrients in there. Uh, it could be negative for the plants and also it could affect the pH of the solution. So I'll just stand up for a second. And there is a fill till here that you can see. And in this unit, it is very easy to fill. You have a nice big opening here and you can easily see the fill here line and then you close that up and then your plants are all fed and good to go I'll show meanwhile in the other machine I have here so this Bounty Elite has been running for quite a lot longer so this one is at the full tree catfuls that it needs because it has nine plants instead of six and it has been going on for 57 days now so they are getting at maturity pretty much And this one is a lot harder to fill up because the meter to see where the water is is way over there. So you kind of have to put some water in and see if it keeps going down. And if uh, you see it stop going down, then it means you're probably just slightly over the line. There we go, let that stop going down. Thank you very much for watching the video. If you liked the video, please click like, subscribe, and share with a friend. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please leave them in the box below. Have a great day, and I'll see you next time.